Alright guys, I'm about to unbox this rather large box from Right Stuff. As you can see down there. So, yeah, it's been a while since I got a good sized box like this. So, here we go. I'm going to, have to put this down on the floor so I can have enough room to do show this. Adjust this a little bit. There we go. Okay. Now, before I begin, well, just to save time, I'm not going to show the insides like I usually do. I'm just going to show the front the spine in the back of each one. Well, save for a little larger item, which I'm going to get to at the end of this video. So, anyways, let's get started. Hold on, guys. Some of these are trapped. Now I'm going to show them in no particular order. I'm going to show them by order of, um, you know, as I get these out. Okay, this is volume four of k -On. I really hope I pronounced that right. I got the other three volumes, which I'm going to get to rather shortly. The Girl Who Leapt Through Time. Okay, this is encoded in Region A only, by the way. Okay, I'm gonna get... Yeah, some of these are wrapped. With the brown paper. So hold on, guys. Alright. Got the first volume of Star Driver. Also got the second one, which I'm going to show pretty shortly. And uh, I think this is in Coin Region A only because it doesn't stay on the back. This is Gundam Double O. Yeah, Double O. The movie. And here's the second Star Driver, which I mentioned a moment ago. And uh, as a bonus, here's another one of those sticky note things with the rightstuff.com logo on it. I think it's my fourth one I got so far. Yeah. More stuff yet. This is the Eureka 7 movie. Good night, sleep tight, young lovers. This is encoded in Region A only. Here's the second volume of K-On! Yeah, all the K-On! volumes are Region A only. Yeah, 
Escaflone the movie. The first volume of K-On! Sword of the Stranger. And, uh, let's see what else. And the, the last Blu ray I'm going to show you, well, not counting the uh, one at the end, the third volume of K On. So that takes care of all the K on volumes. All right, now on to the DVDs. Here's one I'm sure some of you are familiar with. This is Outlaw Star. This is an Anime Legends collection. This is Volume 3 of The Girl Who Leapt Through Space. I'm sure this is no relation to The Girl Who Leapt Through Time as I showed earlier. It's almost a similar sounding title, but I don't think they're not related to each other. I got the other th three volumes, which, um, one of which I'm going to show right now. This is the second volume. The other two volumes, volumes, uh, let's see, one and four I'm going to get to pretty shortly. This is the Escaflone TV series. This is the Super Legends re-release. Oh. <laughs> Turns out I got another Blu-ray to show you. It's also a co it's actually a combo pack. The disappearance of Haruhi Suzumiya. It's actually part of the Haruhi series. Yeah, it's one of those combo packs. It's in a DVD size case, and it's in Region A only on the Blu-ray side. And, uh, and the last two are the remaining two volumes of The Guru Who Let Through Space. This is volume four. And finally, the first volume. Okay, it's, that takes care of all the Bondi stuff. And now, I'm going to clear some space here because, well, I saved the biggest for last. This is, all, this is, a, uh, this is also a uh, Blu-ray DVD combo pack, but it's also an NIS box set. Yep, another month, another NIS box set. This is House of Fine Leaves. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Correction, correction. This is DVD only. I apologize, folks. <laughs> Sorry. This is a DVD only set. My mistake.
I apologize, folks. They were releasing a lot of combo packs. Um, I sort of lost track. So yeah, this is a DVD only release, but it's in a nice uh, premium art box. Well, I kind of wish it was released on Blu-ray, but I digress. So. Now, is it one of those packaging where I rub the... Yep. One thing I like about their shrink wrap, they're easy to peel off if you rub it by the thumb. You know, I mentioned it a lot of times in my unboxings. So... And just like any other NIS set, we got two fin pack cases. Here's the first one. Now this one I'm going to show the insides of because, well, <laughs> it's easy for me to open and the distance, the cases themselves aren't shrink wrapped. Here's the first disc and here's in, uh, if I can get it out. And here's a little advertisement for the House of F Five Leaves manga, which I believe it's complete. And here are some of the other NIS box sets that just came out or about to come out. This is the second volume of uh, Kimimi to Doke. And here's an upcoming one, Occult Academy, which, believe it or not, is actually a Blu-ray only release, which I believe it's a first. And here's the second case. Here's the second disc. And no NIS box that would be complete without oops, the oversized art book. Art and information book or whatever it's called. It looks really, really good. Let me get this back in here. Yeah. Shame that that didn't get a Blu-ray Blu release, but oh, what can you do? All right. Let me just get everything over here. Real quick. Okay, I'll do it this way. So there you have it, folks. That's all I got for this unboxing video. Thank you for watching, and whatever I didn't open, I'll probably show in uh, future show-and-tell videos at some point. Anyways, thanks for watching. This is ProTocu82. Take care, and I'll see you guys next time.